Thank you Hasbro for sending Squirrel Stampede these BotBots Gold Rush Games toys for free. You call them BotBots, I call them Cookie Cookie, yum. They look interesting and all, but I'm just gonna go fishing instead. <laughs> That's right, tiny chipmunk squirrel. Oh no. Oh look, movie tickets. I'm gonna go watch some shows. Squirrel Stampede 2020. Please squirt. I don't care you transformed a cookie, I'm still gonna eat ya. On the table today, it is all about Transformers BotBots Gold Rush Games Series 4 and 5. Thank you very much Hasbro for sending over this giant box of BotBots to explore. Let's get right to these awesome Transformers. Oh, hello. We'll start off with the Transformers Gold Rush Games BotBot Series 5 surprise unboxings. We've got the Gumball Machine and the Claw Machine, each with 10 BotBots inside, including one gold figure. But what BotBot will that be? Great box design with these. These are very interactive. Oh wait, this says Series 4. Why did I say Series 5? Oh, because the surprise unboxers are Series 4. And we have a few Series 5 packs to open afterwards. <laughs> so I've got my eye on this gumball machine. The squirrels really want to know what is inside. Let's get to it. First, removing outer packaging. And I think we're good to go. So let's see, first thing we'll probably want to do is open up this bottom flap. Like a true gumball machine. And then I think we've got this little slider here that should somehow release a BotBot. And for our first BotBot in an orange capsule too. Oh, what could it be? Oh, what could it be? I think it's movie tickets. That's unique and silly. Quick transform. I think that's it on that one. Really quite monstrous. Almost like a red vine monster inside the movie ticket character. I like the little imprints of the projectors on this. Good start. And for our next find. Oh, that works so flawlessly. Got a green capsule this time. So really unsure where the gold will fall. And there it is right after I said it. We found the golden cupcake. Did somebody say golden cupcake? Don't eat that, big gray squirrel. That might make your stomach hurt all that weighted gold inside you. Very nice. Let's transform. And I guess that's it. So far, these have been pretty simple. It's kind of a sad golden cupcake. Poor golden cupcake. Why are you sad? Oh, I can move the arms a little bit, too. Good work, golden cupcake. Let's do one more gumball before we go over to the claw machine for a while. All right, orange. And it's a little blue house. This reminds me of something we may have seen before. Maybe something from the shed heads? It does kind of look like a little shed. Oh, it's a tent, right? With the little tent spikes. And a quick transform. And then we get this guy. He's a little more happy than the first two. All right, how does my favorite claw machine work now? So somewhere, I think there is another opening. So we'll open up this. Exit, open up the exit. I think that's ready to go. And then over here, pull. Okay, watch out everybody, we good, we good? Oh, the whole thing comes out. Oh, there we go. And what do we have? I might not have was supposed to pull that whole thing out. Maybe we'll be shaking it from now on. Who do we have in this one? Oh, come on, how is that possible? The very first one, the golden pencil. There goes all the suspense of this video. No kidding, aren't the Goldens supposed to come later? Okay, what do we have here? Penciltron and transformed Penciltron. Is that its name? Probably not. Kind of like the shiny paint they've got going with these though. There's our two Golden Pop Pots all ready for the Gold Rush games out of the package. And another claw machine bot. 
Oh, there it goes. And we're rolling that way. Oh, took out a squirrel. There we go. What do we got in here? Oh, interesting. It's not a bot bot. It is a sticker. Weird. So it is 10 surprises inside, not 10 bot bots. We have one bot bot sliding on top of the banana gorilla bot bot bot. So who knows what we're gonna get now. Okay, let's try another one. Oh, they're all coming out, they're all coming out. I so did this one wrong. You're not supposed to pull this tab all the way out, just enough so that one comes out at a time, but it's still quite a bit of fun. Very ingenious box design. So a whole bunch of capsules here. Let's start opening these up. Probably the ones that are really light might be a sticker. Sure enough, it is a bot bot uh, milk carton shooting out milk and another sticker. I'm trying to remember all the names of these characters. There's so many. A bot bot dinosaur and another probably sticker. We've got a lot of exploding bot bots. Kind of wish we had a surprise different than a sticker though. Okay, what's in here? Okay, definitely something crunchy. And it is a flower pot of orange flowers. Let's pop open the rest and then we can transform them as we go. Oh, interesting, a purple candy corn. Is that even made? What was the candy corn guy named again? Ooh, is that like a weird 3D chicken bot? I like that one. He won't stand though. And two more to go. We've got the meat. What is this? Oh, it's like a fish. Look at the teeth on that. That is so creepy. And a fish tail. Hmm. We'll get a little closer in a second. And one more. I think this one might be my favorite. I like the corn on the gob. These are all so silly weird. I mean, what is this? 3D chicken bot? 3D glasses chicken bot? The teeth. Very creepy. I like the candy corn in purple. Let's transform these, see what they look like in their bot counterparts. Okay, there we go. Corn on the cob bot is just incredible. I love how the head is kind of hidden behind the corn there. And I love the husk's cape. The flower pot character is a little tricky. I can't figure out how to get the flower pot really above the headline. You can't see the head. It's very much underneath that. Then there's the purple candy corn guy. A lot different than what I remember the candy corn guy looking, but it's still kind of a fun one. It's a better balanced bot bot transformation. Then there's this guy, still don't know what that is. And I don't even know, I think it's dentures. Is it dentures? What is that? I can't even look at it. It's creeping me out. And back to the gumball machine. I think it's my favorite. Works a little more flawlessly. I like the slider technique here. Grabs a capsule, drops it so well. Who's this? I like the clear capsules the best too. But I like how they have different colors. Some are mystery, some are not, some are stickers, some you drop. I think it's a purse. Another clear. Feels like a cookie. And nice blue capsule. These open really nice to a nice little hinge open. And we've got our first sticker of the gumball machine ready to jam. You do have to shake these a little bit. Look at this one stuck up there. I believe you could refill these too for a re-adventure if you wish. Another sticker. This one we've got a bot bot swinging a popcorn bot bot in the air hitting this guy in the face, a bread bot bot sticker. I like the stickers, I just wish there was something one other than the stickers, like maybe a weapon or something. And there's another sticker. These guys are just being super silly. Orange capsule. This has a bot bot for sure. It is weird. Oh, what is this? Oh, is that a s'mores? I think that's a s'mores bot bot. I see a cracker and I see marshmallows. I'm really excited for this one. This one looks really cool. I think the squirrels will like it too. Let's get two more out here, I think, or one more. One more, the last, and then I think we are out of capsule surprises, and then we can get in closer. This one is a sticker of, oh, one of my favorites actually, the pineapple bot bot is really nice just because of the way that sword comes out of its uh, head tuft of leaves. Well, getting closer in, 
Okay, not to confuse you too much, but here are all the Bot-Bots that came out of the Gumball Machine. We had already seen these two before. And of course the Golden Cupcakes. So these three were the ones we just opened. Let's see what they can do. Real close again though. These are amazing. I love this Graham Cracker. And this must be maybe a coin purse. We'll find out maybe as we transform them. And these three transformed. I don't know what to make about this one. I think it's like a bat. I see bat wings on this coin purse, I'm still trying to say. Or maybe it's like a pillow from a uh, casket. Ugh. Cookie Bot turned out great. Oh, there he goes. And then the S'mores Bot. Oh my goodness, what is going on with this one? This might be the most weirdest Bot Bot I have ever opened. I love the arms on this guy, the cookie arms. He's got marshmallow horns. And I guess these are extra arms, I hope. Uh, but this guy is really crazy. And you can see the chocolate too underneath finally. So it's definitely a S'mores Bot. So that is the Gumball and the Claw Machine surprise packs from Bot Bots. These came out earlier in the year, still available on store shelves. I usually see them at Target. They're pretty fun though. I like the mechanics of the boxes and all the surprise capsules of Bot Bots. Stickers were interesting. I wish there was one more little surprise, but really fun overall. Wow, even with the yammering of me at record speeds, there's no way I'm going to get to Bot Bots Series 5 packages. So we're gonna have to split this up into part one and part two. You've just watched part one. So keep an eye out for part two BotBot Series 5 Gold Rush games. There is a lot more BotBots to open and plenty more golden BotBots to see. And I'm sure Optimus Prime and Megatron might even drop by for a visit too. Thank you again Hasbro Transformers BotBots for sending this great pack over. So much to discover, we're doing this in two parts. Keep an eye out for part two. Check your Squirrel Stampede subscription feed. Search Transformers BotBots Part 2 Squirrel Stampede, right? It should be somewhere on the homepage. Give me a day or so to get that going so we can see Series 5. That's what I have to say about that until the next time we say things about that. <laughs> Tell that the bot bots followed you today. They will soon follow Tiny Chipmunk Squirrel and me. Oh, I don't think so. Hey, I've got movie tickets. Let's go watch a show.